As a market leader, you have an important role during the coronavirus pandemic. You help make sure the market stays open and provides your community with supplies and food and your vendors with business and income. By following recommendations in this video, you can use best COVID prevention methods to limit coronavirus exposure in your market. The coronavirus can spread whenever an infected person breathes, talks, coughs, or sneezes by releasing germs into the air that cannot be seen. These germs can float in the air for several hours, and if they reach a person's nose and mouth, that person can easily become infected. People can have COVID-19, feel fine, and do not know they are sick. They can unknowingly spread the disease. That is why it's important to follow local government guidelines designed to stop the spread of the disease. There are three things we can all do to slow the spread of coronavirus in our community. First, properly wearing a clean mask that snugly covers your mouth and nose helps reduce coronavirus germs from being released into the air. Wearing a mask can also reduce your chance of inhaling these germs and helps everyone in your community stay healthy. Second, washing your hands often for at least 20 seconds with soap and water will eliminate germs. If available, be sure to use a paper towel to turn off the water or you may put germs back onto your clean hands. If you cannot wash your hands, regularly use hand sanitizer for at least 20 seconds Avoid touching your mouth, nose, or eyes as much as possible. Third, distance yourself from others not part of your household by two meters, which is a bit more than two arms length, or by the distance recommended by your local authorities. This distance can reduce exposure to coronavirus droplets in the air from infected people. As a market leader, you can take special actions to reduce coronavirus exposure in your market. Clean surfaces daily with soap and water and a sanitizer of a dilute bleach solution, used according to government standards. When using a sanitizer, follow the product's directions as printed on the label and ensure it is safe for use around food. As a market leader, it is your responsibility to provide cleaning and sanitizing materials and ensure that vendors have proper protective equipment for cleaning. Closed toe shoes, gloves, a thick apron, a mask, protective eyewear, or a face shield. Vendors should clean and sanitize all market areas both before opening the market and at the end of the market day. Clothes and gloves as well as face shields and protective eyewear should immediately be carefully removed and washed. Vendors should sanitize their stall table between customers. If possible, provide an area in the market for hand washing. Post signs that show proper hand washing. Ensure that soap and paper towels for drying hands and turning off the tap are available. Hands should be washed for at least 20 seconds with soap and water when arriving and leaving the market and after using the toilet. Do not provide reusable towels because they can transmit the virus. Designate someone to keep this area clean and stocked. Provide hand sanitizer. Check labels to be effective. Hand sanitizers must contain at least 60% ethanol or 70% isopropyl alcohol. Methanol in hand sanitizers is dangerous and should not be used. Provide your vendors with hand sanitizers for use in their stalls. Everyone must properly wear a mask at all times. Vendors should use a clean mask each day. Tables and stalls should be set up with at least two meters separating them from other vendor stalls on all sides. If possible, allow a separate entrance into and a different separate exit out of the market. Indoor markets should open doors and windows to allow for more air circulation. Everyone should remain two meters apart or the distance recommended by local authorities in the market. 
Vendors should only serve one customer at a time to maintain physical distance. If possible, mark the spot where the next customer should wait. Do not allow anyone who is sick into the market. Talk to your vendors about having a plan on who they could send to manage your stall if they or someone from their household becomes sick. Encourage vendors and customers to keep children at home. Limit the number of shoppers in your market at one time to a number determined to be safe by your local authorities. Provide a thermometer and manage a temperature check with a no-touch thermometer at the market entrance. Any temperature above 37 degrees Celsius is above normal. Check with your local authorities to determine the temperature guidelines for entrance to your market. Display signs showing the best practices for reducing the spread of coronavirus at the market entrance. Customers should limit touching products before purchase and vendors should pack goods. This is especially important for bulk goods. Do not allow customers to eat in the market or use communal utensils or cups. Package prepared food in takeaway containers only. Vendors should not give samples. If possible, use mobile money to reduce physical contact during payment. Remember, clean and sanitize surfaces throughout the day. Wash hands or use hand sanitizer regularly. Have everyone properly wear a clean mask. Stay two meters away from one another or the distance recommended by your local authorities.